The Center for Alternative Fuels, Engines, and Emissions at West Virginia University this is over a 25-year-old enterprise uh, focused on emissions control and alternative fuels. And now we find ourselves leveraging that rich history to move into more fundamental combustion and advanced combustion opportunities as well as sensor development to provide the solutions for sustainable transportation of the future. Here at CAFE, we always tried to take laboratory measurements to the field. And part of that in the future will be the, the advancement of onboard diagnostics. So not only the traditional sense of, of diagnosing problems, but also using advanced sensor networks to do basically on the fly uh, certification and compliance for vehicles and, and making vehicle performance and vehicle emissions performance um, uh, more applicable to the real world. Heavy duty engines have progressed over the years and uh, monitoring the health of the after treatment system and the engines is highly critical for emissions compliance and uh, the health of the vehicle. As a result, uh, onboard diagnostics are, are very critical in, uh, in, in letting the uh, driver and the, uh, the manufacturers know when things go wrong with the vehicle. This is a, a safety issue, it's a customer satisfaction and also an uh, environmental issue. So as a result, the different sensors and the vehicle operation has to be continuously monitored and gauged for uh, deviances from normal operation. So the demonstration platform that uh, we have envisioned is, uh, is more to bring uh, manufacturers, academia and regulators into a, into a common platform where, uh, where future uh, trends can be researched, where the manufacturer can, uh, can uh, evaluate any new sensors or any new method for monitoring vehicle health and the academia is, would, would be a, a kind of a liaison between the, the regulators and manufacturers and the, and the academia is going to step in with their own uh, innovative uh, methods of, uh, of, uh, of monitoring vehicle health. The Advanced Combustion Laboratory strives to better predict and control combustion phenomena and emissions formation in the transportation sector. One of the main projects in the Advanced Combustion Laboratory is the development of wireless high temperature and heat flux uh, sensors and measurement techniques for uh, advanced combustion and emission strategies. The research we are doing in the Advanced Combustion Laboratory is going to provide the industry with the tools required to design better and more efficient engines. CAFE started in the early 1990s with funding from the U.S. Department of Energy to look at alternative fuel vehicles technologies. Um, over that time, we've done about $100 million worth of research with commercial, industrial, and government concerns looking to advance technologies for alternative fuel vehicles. CAFE is performing fundamental research in the area of alternative fuels, looking at fuel blending, fuel additives to promote um, increased efficiency and reduced environmental impact from combustion sources. The most exciting part of CAFE is we're developing an optical engine research laboratory that is going to span that gap between the immediate need of industry and the fundamental research and will be one of the only a few places that will have this capability. The future for CAFE is very wide open. I think uh, it's a great time of growth for us. Our staff has almost doubled in size in the past two years and our facilities are growing, we're always bringing online new capabilities. I think the, the future in specific of where we will go will largely depend on the future of these industries that we're involved in. You know, as the automotive industry changes, as things like hybridization and all electric comes on, obviously we'll move in those directions too and we already are. Um, the alternative fuel industry is booming right now, especially with natural gas, propane fueled vehicles, things like that. Uh, but there are other uh, alternative fuels that are on the horizon that are just starting to be looked at. And uh, I think ultimately, the future of that industry will be draw on all of those sources, alternative fuels, hybridization, electrification of vehicles. Um, they're all going to be part of a, a broader solution and CAFE is plugged in in all of those areas and responding to the growth in those areas and growing in those directions as well.